Hello and welcome to Reading Star. Today I have a fall card for you using some clear stamps from Hero Arts. These are some leaf sets. Um, I can't really see that my video isn't clear so I'll make sure and put a link to all the products I used in the description below the YouTube video. So I'm just arranging these on my, uh, this is watercolor paper, Strathmore watercolor paper, and I'm going to be uh, placing these and arranging these on the page the way I like them to appear and just making sure that everything's sort of balanced and even on the card. And once I get these placed, I will go ahead and close the lid to my um, stamping platform. This is the Tim Holtz stamping platform through Stonic, Tonic Studios. Um, I got it on sale at Joann's for like 19 bucks plus shipping and tax, so I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, and to color, the color that I'm going to be using to color these stamps is the Zig Clean Color brush markers and you'll see that in a moment. I'm going to use just basic colors, red, and um, since this, is, this um, color scheme is a split complementary, so I'll be using yellow green and this is just a basic red and then the brown is a neutral and this is supposed to be blue green but the closest I could find in my set of 60 markers was turquoise green so that's what I'm going for so I'm just going to color these leaves um, with this red marker and so I'm coloring all of the leaves completely red and then I'll go in with the brown marker and this is I think the the mid color brown mid brown and I'm just going to be using uh, just putting on little spots here and there to make these appear um, sort of like fall leaves since it's autumn right now and once I get done uh, coloring all of these uh, you'll see in a moment that I'm going to spritz it with water I have a little tube uh, that atomizes the water so that it sprays on with a very fine mist uh, which helps when you're doing this technique with the watercolor and um, also be sure to use watercolor paper because the regular cardstock will uh, start uh, peeling uh, and that's not good you don't want that so make sure you use watercolor paper with this technique so I'm gonna go ahead and let the video play and and let you hear some music and uh, you can enjoy watching this card being made thanks for joining me today and be sure to uh, check out the end of the video where I uh, provide links to my blog and my ebook thank you so much